ever smile on since I can't remember when. Welcome. My name is John. Uh, welcome to John's Bus Conversion. Um, in this uh, video, we're going to take a slight detour uh, from Bus Convert and go check out the Hope Mountain Barter Fair in Cave Junction, Oregon. However, though, um, I think you'll find it interesting because uh, there are a couple of cool buses that I ran into and I had the chance to take a tour of. Uh, one of them has a really cool uh, pop-out like you see on some of the high-end mobile homes and the other one has this really awesome balcony sticking off the back. Um, and we also have a little bit of parkour action uh, from the very talented Julian and a few other kids that were at the barter fair. So I think you'll like it. Stay tuned. <laughs> so what's your name? Corey. Corey. Yeah. And this is, did you make this, this cut out here? No. Um, I got this bus like eight years ago. This thing's really cool. Yeah. This is beautiful. I love these old, these yeah. old. Yeah, it's got the old original motor. It's a KV8 uh, red diamond. Uh, oh, that's cool. Flathead? Uh, yeah, flathead. Does that smokestack up there work? Yeah. Really? Um, actually, right above the um, steering or whatever, that's so, so I don't have the driver's seat in there. And actually, I took the stove out for the murder fair. Oh, okay. But I thought it, I wish I would have kept it in there because it's been raining yeah. the last few days. Oh, I see. You can just hook yeah. it up up there. Yeah. Why that's okay. <laughs> but yeah, and I mean. It's got like a skylight and um, the pop out like is just held in by like I've never seen one of these up close even on anything before. Yeah. Oh I see. I mean it looks like someone who like knew something about sheet metal like, yeah. and fabrication and like and this like pulled up. Oh this is badass. Yeah. Um, this is fucking cool. And there's no track or anything. It's just all in, like muscle, like push it out. <laughs> and it's. Is it hard to pull in and out? Oh, it is. It's yeah. difficult, but I mean, two people can do it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, and I actually bought a uh, high lift jack just to like okay, pick yeah. it up a little bit so you're. I guess you could probably rig some up. I mean, at least it's here, right? Yeah. So, rig some sort of like Z track or something like that. Maybe. Right. I don't know how they do the real ones do it. I've never seen one. Right. Oh, this is nice. I was thinking of doing something like that. The vent? That vent on the coming up from the floor like that. Yeah. And then if you vent the, the nice. ceiling That's or the cool roof, yeah. it should naturally air condition the place. Yeah. And then, I mean, it's got old stove in there, but it's clean. I haven't, you know, used any of these. Hook them up, but like, um, and then full fridge. Oh, sweet. Um, lots of like closet space and oh, yeah. cupboards and... Um, oh, this thing's badass. And then back here... Oh, yeah. Like, oh, okay. Store my blanket stuff right now, but there's a shower. Oh, really? Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. Cool. And then, um... Like, toilet over here. <laughs> and I haven't gone and checked on the plumbing, but... Oh, okay. I mean, it's, you know... No, you know what I've got is i got a dry composting toilet, and that, it works, man. Oh my god, that was cool. Mm. Has a little parkour shirt on there, golden in there. Yeah, Julian. on the Mutt's Fear channel, and this is Ken Kesey's bus, like the legit bus. <laughs> Check this out, this is really cool. I 
I thought about doing this for my bus, but I thought, man, it would make it so long. So what's your name? I'm Amber. Okay. My daughter is Edie in the blue dress. This is a really cool bus. So you said this runs off both propane and electric? Propane and power, yeah. One that is a killer, man. My, I, my fridge is about as big as a little cooler. No, oh, yeah. I love that fridge. Mm, propane. Cool. What do you do for water? Water, I usually have hookups if I'm hooked up, but oh, okay. otherwise it's just that. I haven't oh, quite, I see. Right. You know, haven't got, gotten to the... Oh, that works. I lived like that for 10 years. <laughs> no running water. But usually, so. I'm, when I'm parked, I hook up to a, like a water hose like you would a normal hookup. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cool. Mm -hmm. You got a shot of your wood heater. Is that a wood heater back yeah. there? Yeah. So I was, like, I was totally looking at your... Oh, I see. Cool. Is that a commission right now? Because it's so warm outside. Yeah, yeah. I was looking at your balcony in the back. I got to get a shot of that. Is that? I almost did that to my bus, and I thought, man, it's so long already. I know, it's not so bad. Really? Mm -hmm. My okay. dad. My dad and I drove my bus there and back, and I did probably the majority of the driving. And the few times that anything happened to the bus, meaning he hit like gas station poles. Uh, I did that. <laughs> the yellow mark, that's a gas station pole. He uh -huh. backed into like one of those grease strap trash cans things and it like dented it and hooked onto my bumper and had to like <laughs> jack it up and like push it off. Oh gosh. He hit a, a toll booth or like a ticket booth. Uh -huh. Not a toll booth, but a ticket booth at a parking lot area. It's like, you know, you push the button and the ticket prints out. Well, he uh -huh. went to turn and he clipped it and knocked Oh my god. Oh no. no. I was like, oh my gosh, dad, every time you drive my bus, you wreck something. <laughs> I nailed somebody in the parking lot once in with the back, you know, mm -hmm. and, but I love them to know it, but they never, oh, <laughs> I thought that was me. I'm like, whoa, this is the... cool. bus so hey what's your name uh, I'm wild and freeborn yeah, for like all right and this is your cool bus I know we met in Ashland a couple of weeks ago and uh, yeah it's my family's bus uh, we call her the bus of constant sorrow okay and uh, yeah we have a Facebook page for the bus, right. bus adventures and a YouTube channel and the YouTube channel is Bus of Constant Sorrow. Bus of Constant Sorrow, yeah. And Facebook? Uh, bus of Con the Facebook. Bus of Constant Sorrow on Facebook. Oh, okay. You'll find it, Bus of Constant Sorrow. And I have, uh, from the bus, I have a YouTube channel and I host a radio show, a live radio show every week okay. called The Constant Traveler. So oh, if you go to the Facebook page and look at Bus of Constant Sorrow, I always have the link to the radio show. Or you could just look up uh, The Constant Traveler on Blog Talk Radio. And you were telling me about some guy that was harassing you. Yeah, there's so, a video you can watch on. I'm gonna, I'll put a link to the video in the description, but. Uh, yeah, we were getting, uh, every morning he would drive by the park where people tend to gravitate that live in vehicles and uh, honk his horn at 5.30 in the morning beside each vehicle. So my wife and I set our alarms and got up a half hour before he did and she went across the street and filmed and I went two blocks down in a vehicle we used to have and uh, followed him to work and, and had a confrontation with him. And it's, it actually, I, uh, spoiler alert, it's one of the most redemptive videos uh, that I've ever seen. It's quite All right, well, I haven't, I'm about to go watch it, but I won't give it away. If you guys want to see it, I'll have a link to it in my description and go check it out. Sounds awesome. All right, hey, thanks, man. Yeah, thanks. Let me just do a quick shot of the bus here. This thing is, I, this really, I like the, the paint job on this thing. Yeah, it used to be black and green, we, our first paint job. And we just got tired of it being so dark. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I hope you all enjoyed that. Uh, another little uh, festival in Southern Oregon. Uh, we seem to have quite a few of them down here. 
And uh, coming up in a couple of weeks is the Oregon Country Fair, which is uh, enormous. If you haven't heard of it, Google it. It's, there's only one of, one of those, uh, one like it. It is enormous, uh, and I will be there for about a week. So anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Uh, you guys take care. See you next time. Thank you.